So I'm already crying. I wrote two speeches. One was going to be sentimental and thoughtful and make me cry, but I'm already crying, so that's done. The other one is kind of humorous because I have, um, I have to say I, I love what I do. I love working for Sacramento City Unified School District. I love working at Crocker Riverside. Um, I feel so blessed to be here, and I want to thank um, SCOE for hosting this dinner. I want to tell you this. In 1984, I helped open this hotel. I was working my way through college, and I worked banquets and room service, and I can go back there right now and wrestle you up a little something if you're still hungry. <laughs> And I might still have my uniform and my name tag because I do hoard because I'm a teacher. So <laughs> I want to thank Nolan. I am comforted to know that when I am old and I'm in a home, that Nolan will be out in the world being important because he will be important. Last year, his mother was concerned that he was a little bit shy. And she would push him and say, ask her, ask her. And I'd say, what, Nolan? And he'd say, mm. You ask her, Mom, and you can see that's not a problem. We collaborate in my classroom all the time. We spend a lot of time working together to make sure that learning is meaningful and purposeful. I'm going to say this, though. Tonight is my sister's worst nightmare. Um, to be trapped in a room with all these teachers, Allison, and teachers of the year talking about teaching, and excited about teaching, and the new year teaching. And she's probably going to take a lot of trips to the bathroom because I trap her in the car on the way to Lakeshore, and I talk teacher talk, you know, all about my kids. And I don't know which teacher of the year it was that said, sorry about that, but yeah, we can't stop. Once it starts coming out, it's like, oh, I got to put it back in there. But we're so excited, and we love what we do so much that it is who we are. So I'm sorry about that, Allison, but I'm so glad you're here. I love you. Um, also, my husband is also terrified that I'm standing up here because he lives in a household where he's like, can I throw away the toilet paper rolls now? <laughs> and what kind of plastic bottles are we collecting for your students? Also, um, sometimes he'll say things like, what is this STEM thing that's going on in, your, in the school district? I don't get it. So he, he also asked me about things like, what's this $300 charge for these IKEA shelves that you just bought? And do I have to put them together? And I need two more because I'm moving my room around. So um, mostly he just wonders when he can have his garage back because I've taught a lot of different grades. And I think it's so important. Everything I've ever been trained at has been the best thing I ever knew. So I keep it all, and some of it is so old, and the rats have pooped on it. I mean, it's, it needs to go. Thankfully, my school district this year adopted a new curriculum so we can clean out the garage, honey, so you can, you can thank our superintendent. Um, lastly, I just want to say that um, I'm a good teacher because of all my friends who are good teachers. I walk in their room and I ask their advice. I ask them to tell me, how did you do that? What, that's amazing. I saw some of your kids work and I wanna know how you did it. And I just ask them, because if I don't know and I don't ask, I'm never gonna know. And I want what they have. So I have surrounded myself by the best. I always go right for the best person. Like, hey, you, I want to know what you know. And that's, then I get to pass it on to my children. So um, I also want to thank my district, um, Superintendent Aguilar and my principal, um, Daniel McCord, for being incredible leaders, giving us the training that we need. I'm a training geek. If it's out there and it's a training, I will pay for it. I will go wherever I need to go. I want to be the best teacher I can be for my students. So I just want to thank you for letting me stand up here and pontificate. And I did not read my, the one that made me cry. But um, yay for Teachers of the Year. You guys are amazing. I love teachers. We're not as old as the teachers that I used to have. I remember them being really old. So woo, all right, party on. Thank you.